and today it's in November 2012 time 20 to 9 Central European time so I'm a bit early looks like they've smacked the place out a bit hope it's not too smart I liked it the way it was anyway sure got my ticket to go to Ghent off to Ghent it's a bit of moisture in here I don't think I'm going to video the whole thing I'm ready to roll. So okay, I said I wouldn't video any of it, but they brewed yesterday. And what was in here, where they opened the slats over there to let the wild yeast in, goes down through there. And here it is, you can hear it, settling in here. And I've just been filmed standing over there, peering into the um, by a Japanese TV channel. It's a good job I speak a language. Anyway, a hole so it's nice and fresh and the yeast is all amongst us now. I don't know who that is, but there you go. So okay, now we come on to the tasting. This is year old, one year old lambic. And then we've just lit the fire. Oh, it's sour, it's acidic, it's wonderful. And there's sparkies all over the place here. So here we are in Ghent, and this is St. Peter's, which is like Bruges, is four miles out of the centre. Uh, not mine. That's mine. Anyway, um, should I walk into town or take a tram? I have the information, so I might walk. It's not as cold as Brussels. So, here we are. That's where I've come from. However, there's a castle over there. So I'm going to have a crack at that first. You can't beat the castle. So I must admit, I'm a sucker for castle. And it's up there. Not big, but not bad. And this is number one. And the music's rather good as well. This is Duchess de Bore Doyne at 6.2% alcohol by volume. I can't remember who it's made by. But it's a straight A. A straight A, Mr. Landig. And this is the cup. It's good here. Ignore the glass. Lindemann's pitch beer. Pitch beer. Two and a half percent alcohol by volume. This is good news for me. And I went pitch beer before and this is bursting with peaches. That's not bad. I'm gonna give that a name on this. A little bit too sweet, could be a little bit more bitter, but that's good. Part of the Don Kindle, Bacchus Old Broom, 4.9%. Effervescent. Lacks a bit body. Nice. I think we have Tom Jones on. B plus. Mm. That's the silly. And this will probably be my last. I've seen some. See, that's why this is my last. I've seen on the way in famous Flemish restaurant McDonald's. And it's a long way back. Anyway, the really did trot. And this is the Goose Chapio. No, probably not. Ooh. A 
as good as this go, that's very different. I didn't give that an 8 mine, that's bad. Far more complex than normal. I'm not sure. But it could be a grower. I was going to be on that one, but I didn't bother, but look at this. You thought the Dutch, mind you, Flemish Dutch, it's like central. Um, maybe uh, that's the station. So I suppose the debate is, should I go to Mother Lambics? Should I just go to the chippy? Should I just go back and crash out? Um, uh, I'm fatigued. I'm blaming Flemish bales. Anyway, this is my platform, and as you can see, there's nothing there. I'm a bit early, and I'm missing the security now.